Um, still uh, the hard part to come, but uh, he's definitely looking good and uh, have a strong team. It's the complete package, the team and Simon Yates himself. Yeah, for sure you need to have the legs yourself, but uh, I think uh, like now with all the... <laughs> they already had two good wins and uh, they have the leader jersey and uh, they have uh, big morale and um, that's the most important in a Grand Tour that uh, you have a good uh, confidence and uh, for sure they have and uh, so it's going to be exciting to see if he can hold it. A big guy like you, how do you survive these mountain days? Eat, sleep and rest in good and uh, stay positive. Your gearing? It's still there. <laughs> I think it's uh, 39, 29 today. So you enjoy these Grand Tours, just the longevity of the race, getting into the groove? Yeah, of course. When you, when you had a rest day yesterday, you, your body is uh, really tired today because you had like this rest day, but now you need to get the legs rolling again and uh, we will enjoy it soon. After 20 kilometers, we are, there's maybe 10 groups and uh, then we are angry, but then on the descent, we the morale come back. <laughs> You have a job to do, but you also look for your own uh, opportunities, helping Tim Wellens, but looking for yourself for stage wins like you had in the past. Yeah, of course, I would like to go uh, for a breakaway. Uh, I mean, today is a breakaway day, but it's really you need really the legs because we start up 15 kilometers climb. Uh, you have the legs. Yeah, uh, but I think there's some that have better legs uphill than me. But um, I will try to pick a day, and um, then we see. Thank you.